What's up guys, it's Rick here. Uh, today I'm going to do some overclocking on camera. This is just kind of some suicide runs here, um, so I'm not going to use BIOS, just take too long. I'm just going to use the Easy Tune 6. Um, hopefully you guys can see this well enough, or if you can't, just take my word for it. Uh, let's see, we're going to run Cinebench 11.5. I'm running at stock clocks right now, so let's up our voltage here a little bit. We'll up our memory. Or our uh, CPU, I should say. Just using the multiplier. Start out at... one point four five six volts and that's not under load it'll be probably one point four four or so under load and of course it has to reset our alright we'll try it at three point nine two six at nineteen and a half multiplier Let's see exactly what that gets us I don't know if this is even going to work, but we'll try it. And we are running Kingston HyperX 1600 MHz 99927 1.65 volts on a Gigabyte 990FXA UD5 Phenom 2 X2555 Wow, and after watching those 1100Ts and 8150s, this thing's taking forever. I'm guessing we're probably going to score somewhere in the 3 to 4 point range. I'm surprised it's even still running. I mean, we're running a good amount of voltage. But still, 3.9 gigahertz. Like I said, it's just a suicide run. So I will let this finish, and then I will come back and show you guys the score. Alright, we're just about done. Ooh, lower score than I expected, but... You know, it goes to show you. Two point two four points. Wow. I guess being a dual core, it's about as good as you get. So there you guys go. Two point two four. So there's our Cinebench run at uh three point nine gigahertz. 3.926. Sure, I'll even give you guys a. Uh, there you go, if you could see that. So, like I said, guys, just a suicide run, nothing fancy. You can see our 19 and a half multiplier there. Temperatures barely hit 42 Celsius. And that's just for the fact that, uh, I got the stock fan running 100% and I got a fan from outside the computers up close to the window it looks like our room temp around the computer and our temp inside the case is 26 Celsius so these really aren't totally accurate but there you guys go it's uh, Cinebitch 11.5 at 3.9 more to come